I did some testing on cooking slash ordering meals, hoping to better understand the system in Fire Emblem Engage. I did not do exhaustive testing, but I wanted to share what I found out because my brain is starting to turn to mush after hundreds of resets. There is only one major thing to know about cooking and that it is indeed tied to RNG. You can make the same dish with the same extra ingredients and go from a rank E dish that gives you debuffs to a rank B dish that actually grants bonus stats. Also, even if the dish has stars next to the recipe name, your chef can fail the dish. The system is more complex than just simply adding all the extra ingredients, but for 95 or even 99% of players, this will never be worth stressing about. However, because cooking can fail and it will debuff you, the only thing you need to do is save, then cook. If it's bad, reload and try something else. To elaborate more on my findings, if you are dead set on making a specific recipe, you can reset the cooking RNG by going to a skirmish, entering the prep screen, and then immediately backing out and heading back to the Somnial. The chef will be the same, but the cooking RNG changes. You can also change the chef by resting in your room, and that will change the RNG as well. Regular save scumming does not work. Regarding failing recipes, you can't have a normal dish without adding anything but adding something will then fail the dish. Additionally, it seems like once that bad item is added, no other extra items will fix the ruined dish. As for rare ingredients, I am 99% sure their purpose is support related only. I could have a rank E dish that debuffed my units, but did not improve support. Adding the rare ingredients still got the same rank E dish, but support levels went up. I did not do enough testing, but I am positive the type of rare ingredient did not matter. The result of the dish always seemed tied to the regular extra ingredients only. If they do matter, it's a hidden percentage, and I do not feel like doing hundreds of more trials at the moment. To sum up my findings, cooking RNG is setting stone each Somnial session. To change the cooking RNG, you can go to a skirmish prep screen, then come back to the Somnial. Resting in your room also works, but the chef will be different. Chefs can fail dishes they are supposed to be good at. Because it's RNG and failed dishes can debuff your team, you should always save before ordering a meal. As for rare ingredients, they seem to boost support points. It is highly likely there are specific percentages for succeeding or failing dishes, and extra ingredients affect those chances. A normal player should not worry about this. I can only assume chances are higher that the chef will not fail dishes they say they are good at. Otherwise, what is the point of that, right? Okay. Those are my basic findings on cooking slash ordering meals. Because the chef is chosen randomly, I do not think it's worth worrying about finding the perfect chef with the optimal stat boosting meal. If you want to do that, be my guest. To me, the juice is not worth the squeeze, as they say. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video.